Welcome to this life of ours. Today, we went to Smokehouse Barbecue Restaurant located at 13 Main Street in Dublin, New Hampshire. This restaurant just opened recently. They have another location at 278 State Route 101 in Hammers, New Hampshire that opened in 2017. They renovated the new location in Dublin that used to be Audrey's Cafe. This is a large parking lot but was filling up fast. The grounds are nicely landscaped with a few granite benches in case you need to wait for a table. Their hours are closed on Mondays, Tuesday through Thursday, 11 to 6.30, Friday and Saturday, 11 to 7, and Sunday, 11 to 6.30. When you enter the restaurant, there's a bench if you're waiting for a takeout with some Americana themed decorations. They also offer smokehouse themed t-shirts for sale. Then when you walk into the dining area, you order your food at the counter at the left. And when your food is ready, they'll call your name. There's a bar seating area that overlooks the kitchen area. And also many tables throughout the main dining area. There's a self-serve station where you can get your utensils and extra sauces like salt, pepper, and ketchup. Above the station there's a sign that gives you a description of each of the sauces that they offer. The menu consists of sandwiches, one, two, or three meat plates that come with two sides. Also just meats, sides, kids meals and fried bread pudding for dessert. They have bottled soda, water or iced teas. There are six kinds of sauces on each table. Chicken paste, tangy sauce and house sweet. Also little spicy, ketchup and house gold. My wife had the pick one meat plate. She chose the half chicken on the bone with sides of baked beans and mac and cheese with sourdough bread. I had the pick one meat plate with smoked brisket with sides of baked beans, mac and cheese, and cornbread. Our total bill was $41.49. Here are our ratings. They are our opinions only. For ambience, we give it an 8.9. It is fairly loud inside and the tables are pretty close together. After you order, it is difficult to hear when they call your name to pick up your order at the counter. For food, we give it a 9.4. For the chicken, it was a good size. It was cooked well, juicy on the inside. However, my wife likes the skin a little bit crispier. 
The baked beans were excellent with pieces of pulled pork. The mac and cheese was cheesy, but pretty good. She would get the cornbread next time instead of the sourdough bread. My brisket was cooked well. They gave you the option to get the meat lean, fatty, or both. I choose both. There were four slices of brisket and the flavor was good, even better with the sauces. I thought the baked beans were excellent and the mac and cheese was also good. The cornbread was good and moist, not dry. For price, we give it a 9.1. For lunch, it was a little pricey, but there was a good amount of food and the quality was good. Food prices keep going up, so restaurant prices also continue to rise. For service, we give it a 9.0. It's hard to rate service when you order at the counter and pick up at the counter. The staff members that took our order were pleasant. For cleanliness, we give it a 9.5. It's a fairly new restaurant. The tables and the floors were clean. Tables were clean as soon as customers left. The self-service station was kept clean and the trash was emptied promptly. In our opinion, that stretch of the road needed a restaurant. So if you're in the mood for barbecue and you're in the area, give the Smokehouse Barbecue a try. Please like, share, and subscribe as that does help out our channel. Thanks for watching and hope you join us on the next one.